this is as far as I can go, man. Welcome to the war council, my boy. Gentlemen, what's going on? Nothing. Discussing pest control. Well, I've given you my advice, Peg. You do what you think is best. I agree. Finally. I mean, I don't agree with what he says. I agree that you know best. Excuse me? Relax. I didn't mean nothing by it. Look, either we make the right call or we all end up in prison anyway. Well, your crap ain't gonna do me no favors. Be careful. I'll see you later. Boss, gentlemen, you're only an associate, Phil. Remember that. Yeah, yeah, okay, tough Boss, guy. I gotta tell you this. He's not straight. Right before I came in here, I saw him talking to Angie again. You better leave. Uh, I need to speak to Nico. Sure, boss. But, uh, think about what I said. I will. You know? Trust me on that. We got real problems. Police are all over us. Maybe you heard, I got served papers today. Phil yesterday. We got a couple of boys in jail. I think they might squeal. Somebody's talking. Wants us out of the picture. Maybe John Gravelli. Or them Ancelotti's. Somebody got to my people. So what are you going to do about it? I don't know. I gotta shut someone up and show people I mean business. I've known Phil a long time. He's straight, more or less. I know him and Angie are friends, but that don't worry me too much. Hmm. Maybe he's too straight. Then there's Ray. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't trust him. But he's a good earner. I know he's got his eye on the big prize, but he's no dummy. Him and Phil hate each other. I gotta think about it. Okay. I'll give you a call. Whoever I say to go see, go see him. And shut him up! there in no time. Great, thanks. Nico, I've been thinking about it and I want you to pay our friend Ray a visit. Give him a message from me. He's at a sit down on Card Row in East Harlem. If that's your decision, Mr. Pegorino, it's done. Thanks. I see his car. He should be heading over to a chop shop in Moabo. Don't get too comfortable with him, Nico. Like every rat, he's a survivor. He's got good instincts. He has a bad feeling about you in particular. He bought some protection, and he ain't gonna hang around and wait for you know what to happen. Then again, I'll get a chump muscle and stuff for gas out of the way. It might create a good opportunity.
The meeting went to plan, Mr. Begorino. Wait enough, it's a tough job, Pelican. I don't got much left in mind, it's so clean. I'll talk to you soon. Uh -oh. Drive! You got it! Alec, I have your man. He's been thrown in. We're going to drop him in the airport cargo area for you. No more jobs? Is that it? Am I out? You're out. You've done good things for us, and we are grateful. That said, I've given you a lot of protection. From here in, you're alone. Goodbye. Here we are, man. End of the line. They are bringing him to the cargo bay at Francis International. I do not want to be late after I've waited so long. Hurry this shit up! Well, this is the big moment that you've been waiting for for so long. I hope you will not be disappointed. Disappointment is not a consideration. I have not been the same man since the day that Darko betrayed us, since I saw those things. You lost a lot of friends that day, Nico. We both did. In some way, my friends from the village were lucky. I lost myself that day, too. Everything that was good and innocent in me died along with them. If I could live those hours again, I think I would have preferred to be buried in the pit along with everyone else. This is all that is left of me. What am I good at, Roman? What is my trade? I deal in death. Because that is all that is open to me. I will tell you what you are good at, Nico. My you are a good cousin and a good friend. You still have integrity. No matter what you say, there is humanity in you. You still have the power to be good. It's important that you believe that. Maybe I will start to believe it when Darko is dead. That might give me some perspective. This killing must stop sometime, Nico. Once this is done, then you must begin to forgive. Think about your future instead of the horrible things that have happened to you. To us! To all of us! In the past! After this is done, then we can talk about forgiveness and redemption. Now is not the time for such conversation. Come on! Sorry, man. This is the close I can get you. This is it. This is where it all ends. You remember me? Pusseme, ne poznajet. I don't know you. Yes, you do. I'm the one who survived. Let's see me zašto. Zašto? Zato što smo bili prijatelji. Svi smo odrasli zajedno. Mitar, Dragan, Goran, Mio. Mogu da nastavim. Svio, ha? We were friends, but I had other friends. Friends that Goran and his guys killed. My fucking neighbors! Because of what? Because of shit. Lies. Fucking lies. So that makes it okay to stab your friends in the back? Strange choices. Fuck you! <laughs> Strange choices! How much? <laughs> A thousand. <laughs> you killed my friends for one thousand dollars. How much did you charge to kill someone? You ruined 
me, you fuck! I visit the money. I had problems. You're a fucking junkie! Kill me, Dan! You fucking hypocrite. Trust me. You're doing me a favor! Nico, come on. Look, let's go. Let him suffer. He, he knows what he did. It doesn't look like he enjoys life too much. Dude, come on. Living will be more painful for him than dead. Let's go. Will you take me over to Bruce's house? I've been empty ever since that day. I thought that revenge and killing Darko might fill me up with it. It might give me some substance. And it hasn't? No, it hasn't. Does that make you happy? Of course it doesn't make me happy, but maybe this is good for you, maybe. Now that you know that revenge is not what you are after, you can look for Fulfillment in other places. Healthy ones. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Here we are, man. End of the line. Here we are. Do you want to come in and hang with Brucey? No. I need to be alone. Thank you for being with me, cousin. Do not mention it. Call me, Nico. The wedding is soon. Florian, I thought you should know. Darko is dead. He's finally paid for his crimes. That's good to know, Nix. You should let go of it now. You have a new life in America. Forget the past. Sometimes I think my past is all I got. So long. You look after yourself. 
stay calm and you won't die. 